three Rota Huskers. As Davis gets the scoring started for Tom Fisher post game. Yeah, from what I've seen from Thompson Rivers, they really want to do an inside out game, really focus on getting the ball down low. Picked off by Bilos. Going one on one against Mazatinic and use the foot. Mazatinic looking for reinforcements. Peterson, a wide open Oviat, lays it in. For the defense, and it's just not working right now for them. Funa is back in, along with Hutchison. They exchange the basketball, so is Rota Huskers. Fires from about 18 feet. Jeff Rota Huskers, he's got six points, and the horse. Yeah, you might match up height wise with Jeff Rota Huskers, but not many people we've seen in Canada. Up high for Sabenko, tosses it over for Davis, and he knocks down a three pointer. Joe Davis, he's fine. Peterson finds Rota Huskers and he just too big just <laughs> outpowers them. Just flashes the bicep as he runs by the bench too. Time winding down, three on the shot clock. Majetto got to the rim. Michael Ruwalt, Joe Davis, Cameron Sabenko, and Anton Bilos all in their fifth year. And Bilos. Peterson for three, hit his first three-point attempt in the first half. Hits his first three-point attempt here in the second. Still the Horns lead by three. But already offensively for the Horns, there's a lot more movement. Um, guys setting a few more picks. Giving us open shots just like that one. Ooh, Ward hits the deck, DeVries for three. Money. Game's real. 10 seconds on the shot clock. Davis left open for three. And now the three pointer's starting to hit. Up high now. Peterson crossover dribble. Had a lane instead. He found Gibb on a cut. There's what the assist pass. of the night. Milos, the rebound. One minute played in the fourth quarter. Gibb the theft. Ahead to Peterson. And he lays. Gibb on the take, rims out, loose ball poked away by Funa to Gibb, handoff to Mazatinic. He's heating up in the fourth. Ten points. Crossfield on the bounce and got it to go. And that'll do it. What a second half for the Hordes. Yet again, they do it on back-to-back -back nights. Almost a mirror image of one another, these two games, but the Horns even stronger in this second half, and what a feeling.